I live in South Florida and today we're free diving just off the beach. Let's go see what we can find. As soon as I dove down, I saw this white spotted file fish. They have scales that feel like sandpaper and this roughness is how they got their name. Over here we have some pork fish, the first of two fish named after pigs that we'll see today. And here's a yellow stingray. I see them almost every dive and they have 360 degree vision so they definitely see me too. Look at that pancake go. These purple sea fans are so pretty. And look, it's a hogfish and a very scary trigger fish in the background, if you know, you know. Hogfish are masters of camouflage, so believe it or not, this is the exact same fish as the previous video. Hogfish get their name from their long piggy snout, which they use to dig around in the sand for crabs and mollusks. Kind of reminds me of a Pringle duck face. How cool is she? Here's a striped burfish. Their patterns look like a maze from the back of the kids' menu. Check out this guitar fish, one of my favorite residents of the reef. They're ambush hunters and their freckles help them blend in with the ocean floor. There's so many fish on the reef today. A green turtle zoomed by me. She was really on a mission. Her shell was so dark, it was very unique. This school of doctor fish, on the other hand, was not in a hurry. They're called doctor fish because the lines on their sides look like they're made by a scalpel. It's hard to believe that all of this is just a short swim out from the beach. To finish the dive, I blew this wobbly bubble ring and then I blew my mind by blowing my first perfect bubble ring, but I didn't start recording until right before I got to the surface. Thanks for coming on my dive. I'll see you next time I'm at the reef.